Hi, it's Rhonda from FunnelWise, here to bring you another metric video tip. This one's on velocity. So marketing and sales professionals are always looking for ways to make their funnel uh, perform better. And so one way to do that is through funnel velocity. So on a very high level, um, it calculates the speed at which a lead moves through your funnel. So day one, a prospect enters the first stage, and then it takes it goes through the six stages to close one. And on average, that's 60 days. A lot of people will figure out uh, their average velocity by stage, and they'll just do um, take 60 days, six stages, 10 days per stage. However, this can be very misleading. Um, it assumes kind of a flat distribution that leads move from stage to stage every 10 days. And that's, that's pretty untypical. So if you kind of look at it as instead of an, an inverse bell curve, you may have some that move in and move out very quickly. They'll only stay for one or two days. And then you might have a group of leads that stay longer. So how do you get this information? Well, by using stage by stage analysis, it can help you determine where your leads are speeding up or slowing down. And so taking that same funnel in those same stages, as you can see in January, we've calculated on average how many, how many days it takes for a prospect to move successfully forward. So let's go over to the table and it, as you can see, it's not 10 days. The stages only took five, took 10, 10 days and engaged. And overall though, it was still 60 days. Now, when you compare that to the next month in February, you see your days increased by 66. Well, where did it take longer? Only by doing that stage by stage analysis are you able to identify those areas to optimize and really achieve exceptional velocity performance. So I highly recommend checking out doing velocity with a stage by stage analysis. We have a great, um, Velocity cheat sheet that there's a link to at the end of this video. I encourage you to check it out or visit our website for all the different other resources that you can use to create a high performing marketing and sales funnel.